I don't know, man. I'm so confused now. I can't see anything. I can't taste anything. I want to lick my fingers. I can't see them. <laughs> Matt Bolas on Love Bites. Love Nashville, Bites. Nashville, Tennessee. That's right. Matt is a chef at 404, which I just did a dinner with him three or four days ago, which was awesome. You killed it, wasn't it? Yeah, Super really fun. awesome. So Matt, you started at 404 when? Uh, four years ago, five four, years ago. Five years ago. Yeah, we opened four years ago. But we got more exciting news coming out of the Matt Bolas camp, more which is? News. We're moving across the street, and we're opening up uh, like my dream restaurant. It's going to be, we're going to have room for, for what we do now. We're going to have room for more family style stuff. We're going to have room for a lot more whiskey. Uh, and, and fun bar snacks. You drink, you drink whiskey? I drink whiskey. Okay. I drink tequila. Sure. I drink wine. Okay. Beer. Like you like water. You don't, wanna <laughs> you don't wanna discriminate. No, 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 no. I <laughs> think you don't discriminate. No. That's fair. Well, Matt, here at Love Bites, we do one thing, that's spin the wheel. Are you ready? <laughs> spin it up. Oh, Go with your cut above me. <laughs> And he gets a cut of up, ladies and gentlemen. One thing I wonder what this is going to be epic. It's going to be epic. Let me give you the rules of cut above. First, you're going to get a blindfold. <laughs> and hold an apple. Then we're going to steal your shoes. And yeah, you're going to hold an apple and then we're throw darts at you. Sweet. No. Uh, blindfold, we're going to bring in four cuts of meat. You're going to taste them blindfolded and tell me what the cut is. This is so exciting. Epic. <laughs> All right, I'm we're gonna bring in the steak set. Here we go. I'm not looking forward to this. Come on. <laughs> hey, Levon was very particular about how his bandana was rolled. Just no so he was. <laughs> Born and raised in East Los Angeles, I'm a little particular about how I fold my bandana. <laughs> <laughs> I'm from LA, man. I roll my own bandana. You're, like, okay. you're doing that wrong. My yeah. bad. Sorry about that. You don't want to get on the wrong side of that turf. No, you don't. All right, there you go. <laughs> All right. Blindfold it up. Here we yep. go. In just a second, our cuts of meat will come in. Fuck it. <laughs> God damn it, Tim. I don't mean to cuss on your channel. You can cuss all you want on my channel. We're sponsored by Fuck Anonymous. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, what are you about to say? This is gonna happen. I'm gonna cut them, I'm gonna give them to you. I'm gonna tell the audience what it is. Kinda like that show Passwords. <laughs> <laughs> and uh. then you, sir, are gonna tell us Exactly what it is. Are you serving me weird shit, Tim? There is, uh, here's the deal. There's one thing I can guarantee you, there's no beaver anus. We've told that to everybody, so the rules are the same. All right. Are we ready? Yeah. Yeah, why not? Cut number one. <laughs> this is so great. <laughs> Chewing. Processing. You know what it is. Go ahead and say it. Beef. Well, it tastes like deckle. Beef deckle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or hanger steak. Beef deckle or hanger steak. We gotta make some decisions. Um, I'm gonna go with deckle. It seems more your style. Beef deckle. Okay. Cut number two. Mmm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Hmm. Never heard of that cut. Hmm. Is this all the same Processing. Cut? You're just cutting different pieces off the same steak, making us look like dicks? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> That's what this is. Strip. Okay. Next. Cut it the same way. <laughs> Is that a pork chop? Pork chop? No. Yeah. Well, I'm not gonna tell you yet. Pork chop? Yeah, I'll go pork chop. That's right. delicious. Whatever. Pork it chop. Was. Stop cutting them the same way, Tim. Now this smells like the pork chop. Processing. That's pork chop. That's pork chop. Okay, good. 
And one more. Oh, there's five? Yeah. <laughs> I thought we had something going before this. I thought we were friends earlier. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? Hmm. Hmm. That's what I was going to say. Hmm. Just don't punch me after you take the blindfold off. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, make a call. Fuck, I don't know, man. I'm so confused now. I can't see anything. I can't taste anything. I want to lick my fingers. I can't see them. <laughs> you got to make a decision, son. It wasn't chicken. It wasn't beef. I don't think it was beef. Elk? I don't know. It doesn't taste like okay, elk. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go over them for you. You said beef, <laughs> beef deckel. Yeah. New York strip. I'm an idiot. Pork chop. <laughs> pork chop. <laughs> I should have said pork chop again. Is okay, like take pork the house? blindfold off. So you got ribeye cap, which is right. Oh, New yeah? York strip, which is right. Beef tenderloin, which is not a pork chop. Oh. Lamb T-bone, still that not didn't a pork taste chop. Like, that didn't taste like lamb at all. And, <laughs> And then you had the pork chop at the end. God <laughs> damn it. I'm fucked up, man. Two out of five ain't bad. It's a good batting average. It's, I'm saying, dude, hey, most people get, get hired a, for that I shit. I would get a good contract in the majors. Okay, we got one thing left. You're going to make the best peanut butter and jelly sandwich you ever made in your life over in the peanut butter and jelly studio. Are you ready? Let's do yeah, it. That's my game. I'm taking my pork chop with me. <laughs> All right, back in the peanut butter and jelly studio, my favorite spot. Soon I'll be releasing thousands upon thousands of peanut butter and jelly sandwiches all across the country. But today, today, sir, you have yeah. the opportunity to make the greatest peanut butter and jelly sandwich in the world. And I got to tell you, there's a lot of competition out there. I got a game plan. You got four minutes, and I got rapid fire questions while you do it. Yeah. And if you fuck up good enough, I'll give you a shot at tequila. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> all right, go. All right. Here we go. Tequila or mezcal? Uh, mezcal, always. Sriracha or Cholula? Cholula. Bacon or sausage? Oh, what kind of bacon, what kind of sausage? Jesus, really? Yeah, I mean, are we talking like Italian sausage with peppers and onions? Or are we talking about Benton's bacon? Is there mayonnaise involved? There's a lot of questions there. How about bacon and mayonnaise or sausage and peppers? <sighs> sausage and peppers. Yeah, that's a lot of decisions. <laughs> Chicken oyster, real oyster, or Rocky Mountain oyster? Chicken oyster. Okay. Yeah. He's getting a lot of ingredients here, folks. I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to think of a good balance. You know, less is more. They always say that. Less is more. That's why I'm going whole wheat. Prosciutto or country ham? Country ham. Ribeye or pork chop? Fuck, don't <laughs> tumble. Uh, <laughs> uh, you ribeye. know what a pork chop is? Yeah, I know what a pork right, chop is. Okay. I ate three of them. I know. <laughs> I ate three of them in a row. <laughs> Fondue or queso? Queso. Pellegrino or Topo Chico? Topo Chico. Negroni or paper plane? Negroni. Do you know what a paper plane no. is? Like would you <laughs> fold up and throw at people? I don't know. <laughs> Nobody knows what a paper plane is. <laughs> okay, fair enough. It's in my nose to say it, and I don't even know what a paper plane is. I'm not joking. Can I borrow your knife? I'm searching for somebody who knows a paper plane. Burger or hot dog? Uh, but, you know, again, what are we talking about? A Fenway burger bar? or a hot dog, uh, son? Uh, burger. Smash Jeez. burger. Cheese. Cuban or Reuben? Oh, Cuban. Easy. Mesquite or hickory? Oh, never, never, never mesquite. Jesus Christ. So against mesquite. That's why I fucked you over over there. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Same question. Texas or Tennessee? Oh, Tennessee. Football, drinks, living, everything. Yeah, I know. I'll take the football. I'll take the football. <laughs> You ever been to a banquet recently? <laughs> yes, I have. Where they have the preset dessert? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, when was it? Um, in October. Uh, no, okay. no, 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 no. It was in uh, end of end of uh, July. Tell me the event. It was uh, a Tate event, National Wine Auction. Perfect, okay. 
The dessert was preset. Correct. I'm going to guess what your meal was. OK. Uh, it was chocolate. Yes. Chocolate mousse. Kind of. Kind of. Like, Here we go with the shit. What was it? It was, well, it was, it wasn't mousse like you and I know it. It was like this rolled up mousse, and then it had some bananas and this weird. Yeah, chocolate yeah. mousse, but it was stable. Yes. <laughs> it was stable. Very All much. All right, the salad was mixed greens. Yes. With California cheese. mixed greens, <laughs> with crappy cheese on top. And then <laughs> the dessert, I mean, the, the, the dressing was definitely in a boat. Yeah. That you passed around, but it was that, ranch. But it looked like but Caesar. A, but yeah, that's, that's right. Yeah. They probably called it Caesar. We're going to make it. All right, here we go. Jelly ever. Describe your peanut butter and jelly sandwich. It's the most balanced peanut butter and jelly you've ever had. Okay, oh so God. you start with seven grain for your health. Right. Okay. Then you get into to creamy, not crunchy. That's very important. Okay. Texture comes from the potato chips, bananas, Nutella, apricot preserves, and Lay's potato chips. All right. With the salt, and sugar. Love exactly. It. Love it. Cut it on a bite. Cut it. Yeah. Absolutely. I think get a corner. It, because you can get more in each bite. That's right. Because after the first bite, you strategically place it to where you can get all the others in. in. Definitely the sweetest peanut butter and jelly I've had. I'm yeah. Sure. And not bad, really. You want to hit it? Yeah, you do. Right. Oh, wow. Salty from the chip. Crunchy. Right? You got it's a nice peanut butter and jelly sandwich. You got a Matthew, it. thanks for being on. Oh, thank you guys. You should open a restaurant. These are love bites. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll try that maybe. <laughs>